no one knows exactly how, but Joy Milne is a walking, talking medical breakthrough. Her husband Les was diagnosed with Parkinson's 20 years ago, but before he was, she noticed that he smelled different. The heavy musk smell. No, it's not like sweat, it's, it's nothing like that. It is, a, it is a completely distinct smell. Joy had always known she had a very developed sense of smell, but it took her another 15 years to work out how important this smell might be. It wasn't until we walked into the Parkinson's group in Perth um, and I then realised the other people around us would smell like Les. And then I made the connection. And so Joy told a researcher who designed a test. Using just the smell on people's T-shirts, they found Joy could tell who had Parkinson's every time. How? Well, they're working on that. We know that Joy is smelling a molecule, and we know that molecule must be volatile. It must be able to go through the air and get into her nose. So what we're going to do is, is take molecules from people's skin um, and analyse them. Now Joy has triggered a major study. This research at the Institute of Biotechnology in Manchester could lead to a simple swab test for a disease which is painful for the sufferer and for the people who love them. Les died four months ago. I, I'm missing him terribly, but it would be wonderful. Mm, it would be really wonderful if it uh, did this. There is no cure for Parkinson's, but science could now be getting closer to slowing it down, thanks to Joy and her nose. Dominic Reynolds, 5 News.